Right now, I'm with Danny Watson from the IoT Solutions team. Hi, Danny. Hi, nice to meet you. How's it going? What do we got going on here? Uh, so what we're doing is we're doing uh, facial registration and facial recognition directly on NXP Silicon. Uh, so what we do is we do training. Uh, so you click the train button and we start taking uh, 128 data points of your left and right center of your face. So as you can see is the percentages on the left and right hand side. Uh, as I turn, it starts taking more points. And we take the left hand side and when it gets to 100%, we start crunching the numbers. So we are nearly there. So as what it's doing now, it's essentially crunching uh, numbers, taking all the frames of your face, and it creates 128 data points of your left, right, and center of your face. When it does that, it pops back with the information. This is all done on the uh, our Layscape and our IDMX ranges. Uh, and as you'll see, it'll pop back and we'll start asking to recognize. Um, and it pops up there, and as you can see, it pops up with my name, saying it's recognized at 100%. Wow. So the great thing about this is when we register, we've got a full edge computer experience. When the uh, recognition is done, it populates to every single device, and it, all the facial recognition gets run directly on the uh, on the landscapes or the IDMXs. Really? Yeah. Wow, awesome. So what are like the key applications that this is primarily used on? Uh, so we've got things like door locks uh, for security. So when you go up to the door locks with the cameras, you can actually see um, basically get door access. There's other things like security cameras to make sure uh, the right people are in the actual uh, building and if there's any unknowns, it could potentially report those types of uh, people wandering around. Awesome, the whole shebang. Yep, Perfect, exactly. well, thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Awesome. Thanks.